welcome back to another video. In this video we're making um, chocolate chip cookies but it's not going to be with cacao powder so they're not double chocolate chip cookies like the recipe I made a couple of weeks back. These are going to be just plain with choc chips and yeah just as tasty um, and yeah these are all the ingredients you're going to need to be able to make it. Okay, so what you will need is um, some oats that I'm going to blend into, um, I'm going to blend in the blender and blend into flour. Um, some dark chocolate bits, so <clears throat> these are a Nestle brand because that was on special at the supermarket. And there's no dairy in them, so that's good, but I don't know how great the brand Nestle is. But any dark chocolate bits. Um, some vanilla extract some um, almond butter, this is um, some chia seeds that I've blended up in a coffee grinder and then I've just added three tablespoons of water, so that's um, that was one tablespoon of chia seeds and then blended. And some coconut oil, this is some bicarb soda or you can use baking powder as well, but um, I just use bicarb soda. And some sugar. So this is coconut sugar here, but it'll work with any sugar. And yeah, that's all you're going to need. oven and I'm going to bake them for probably around 13 minutes and um, the lot the less you bake them for the chewier they'll be so if you like your cookies a bit chewier then bake them for less if you like them a bit crispier then bake them for more um, yeah so that's it really easy and they're going to be really delicious because cookies pretty much always turn out delicious because I mean it's pretty much just like the sugar to oil or the fat ratio that you use um, but as long as you don't use too much flour, if you use too much flour, they'll be like more of a crumbly cookie. If you use too much oil, they'll be kind of like a really oily, buttery cookie, obviously. And um, I've noticed that the more sugar you use, if you use lots of sugar, you get like a um, like a beautiful crust. You know those crusts on top of like the muffins? Um, that's what you get if you use more sugar. So if you want to use a bit more sugar to get the crust, then go for that. Um, and yeah, so that's it. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. I'll do some shots of how they turned out um, after, so you get to see that. And yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.